Boom. Is it going to be there? Ah, yeah, it's One, two, two. It's, it's recording. I always <laughs> laugh at when, is it? Yeah, yeah. No, you wait. <laughs> Today, we're going to talk about an article I read recently. And we're in a lovely train station here. Yeah, you can see in the background we're in the train station. We just finished a gig in Shinjuku, so we have some extra time, so back to the article. The article talked about uh, genetics and Japanese people, specifically genetics having to do with anxiety. So they talked to a psychologist, and the psychologist said that most Japanese people, up to 80%, had a specific gene. And this gene limited the amount of serotonin circulating in their system. And without this serotonin, you don't get that sense of happiness. In fact, you have anxiety. So he blamed uh, Japanese people's anxiety on this. And so it led to stinginess. Yeah, well. he said that anxiety led to stinginess. So. I don't know if this is true. The anxiety thing, I kind of agree with them with. There are lots of Japanese people I know that had yes. anxiety, but I don't know if too many people are stingy. I'd say the opposite. I'd say the Japanese people aren't stingy. I, I agree with you. I think that, you know, since I've experienced you know, people being very generous, and uh, I think also people, you know, spending money on themselves, even on small things. Yeah. They treat themselves to things. And yeah, the Japanese people, they do like to treat themselves. Yes. So Japanese Especially people, women. <laughs> Who doesn't like to treat themselves though, really? Yes, but not just to like clothes and stuff, even to like, you know, go out to tea, go out for... You know, snacks. lots of people like to treat themselves to like really delicious food. Yes. They have like some special That's food true. they like and they'll treat themselves to that or like some special beer. So I don't think people are stingy with that type of thing. Have you noticed that? Do you think Japanese people in general are stingy? Uh... Yeah, I, not stingy, because I don't like that word, stingy. I think everybody has a right to do what they want with their money. But at where I work, they're always giving gifts and little... That's true. Know, walking around giving every teacher a chocolate or mm -hmm. something from where they went recently. Mm -hmm. And there is a culture of gift giving here, which yeah. is... Yeah, the opposite of stingy, yes. I think. Although I have heard, somebody told me that their husband, he had a pair of shoes. She said, like, she's really stingy, he had a pair of shoes. And he used them so much, the heels started running out. So instead of throwing them away, he just cut the backs off them and turned them into slippers to wear around his house. <laughs> so some people call that stingy. That is fast. Oh, that's my resource. 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 That's the word I use. Uh, yeah. I love that. I love that. Yeah. Because I taught someone recently whose whole company was at going and getting things and then sending them off to other countries. Picking up fridges and computers. Yeah, it was great. I love that. Reusing, repurposing. And recycling. I'm actually quite the opposite. I'm actually, I think I'm kind of wasteful. I'm kind of wasteful you know, too. Uh, if something is, if some, like clothes and things, if they get a little bit old, I'll throw them away. Or even if I get bored of them, I still... I don't know, I wear old clothes all the time. Probably look pretty bad. I should probably stop. I'm a worker. Yeah. If, if you like the word stingy, I'm stingy. Yeah, I, I'm actually stingier than probably 99% of Japanese people. Yes. Yeah. Definitely, that's, that's true. So, I think, uh, in that case, I think the article is wrong. Although I do think lots of Japanese people have anxiety. Yes. Especially young people, that's I think something that's a lot yeah. of younger people, you know. Yeah, are worrying How do you not. see anxiety there? What do you see? Like, for example, people will be afraid to do something if they think oh, they might God. fail yeah, or do something in front of other people. I think a lot of people won't uh, speak in front of people or do you know anything in front of other people. So or go against the crowd or go into yeah, against the group. Exactly. So I think people are anxious or just to do anything like for job interviews or Has any kind of thing. I don't or think it does. Yeah. That's what the yeah. what is it? That's what Ta Takumi, I think was his name. The psychologist, he said it led to stinginess. I don't think it does, because I don't think they're stingy. Because it's a different thing. Yes. Yeah, I think it's, it's completely different. If there's one thing everybody's good at, it's spending money. <laughs> so there's no fear of failure of spending money. How can you fail spending money? <laughs> you should have spent it and it's gone. Yeah, <laughs> <it's> <laughs> <been good>. Nothing <laughs> easier than that. <laughs> I've done it. <laughs> Succeed every time. <laughs> at least you spend it on me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well... That's it for that topic. 
have any comments or questions, leave them below. Thanks. Bye. Goodbye.